Somebody want to go sit in it? Yeah. Are you trying to volunteer me? Charlie, we'll <laughs> go sit in it. Take the keys. Oh, no, the key. Get the key. Hurry up. Hurry up. Oh go, my go, God. Go, 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 go. Good luck in that canopy open. <laughs> right. So they're going to go sit in the plane. Oh, That's... something already flew by. Oh, something just flew away. Signs are getting more away. <laughs> this is the craziest. Oh, oh, oh there goes his hat. hat. That's gone. Sh should I go get it? Yeah, it's still safe. Go get it. I'm gonna go get his hat. Hurry. I'll be back. You're a hero. Oh, he's, he's getting it, I think. He's getting it. He's getting it. No, he's getting it. <laughs> <laughs> he's getting it. Uh, oh, something just hit us. Something just hit us. You just missed your, it just missed your legs. <laughs> Whatever it was. Dude, I'm soaking wet right now. <laughs> yeah. Like, I'm not even kidding. Look how wet right now, yeah. That. As soon as you stepped out, a huge wall. So, right out. now, the storm started hitting the 40s, started moving a little too much. So, Franklin and Charlie ran out and they sat in the plane <laughs> to make a nose hat. heavy. That's hilarious. The 40s definitely not moving now, though. So, them being in it definitely helps. How weird must that be for them? Because we're never in planes when it storms. Right. So. <laughs> Well, they're still in there. <laughs> Trying to repair a leak. So how was it, guys? <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. Hey, we put on our crosswind that. correction and the plane's still here. So <laughs> all worked out. Got some lift, but we're here. That's so funny. Look at that. Snap tree. Another one up here. There's one in the middle of the road. There's another one knocked over. There's a bunch of porta potties. A ticket booth flew out. That's crazy. So everything turned out fine. We didn't see any flipped over planes or anything like that. Um, we are now going to eat at a restaurant called Beckett's. It's a seafood joint. And it's in a really weird spot. Kind of joking at the idea that it's a restaurant and a parking garage. I'll show you. <laughs> Uh, almost the whole section that we're in here, this little area, like completely lost power. So we're going to try this out and hopefully they have power so they can cook food. <laughs> Okay, it is Sunday, July 24th or something. We picked up this guy, he was homeless. <laughs> this is Caleb White. He was one of our graduates and he was actually volunteering at Oshkosh um, and his tent got destroyed in the middle of the night during that storm. So we let him stay in our humble abode because we like to help out our local peasants. So, <laughs> so anyways, we're working right now on the brochure box. This is what will hold our flyers. It'll go to Diamond's booth but our flyers are small, so they just fall all the way to the bottom. So him and I are doing a little bit of arts and crafts right now to make it where that won't happen and the flyers can stay a little higher above because we've got these little foam box we're cutting out. And the flyers will sit on those and stay high. Stay high as in height, not, okay. <laughs> That looks weird there, but I promise you it looks good in person. All right, cool. So we got that all taken care of. We're going to go pick up the some of the guys. Sounds like some are still sleeping. <laughs> so we're going to pick up some of them, go to Lowe's, take care of a few more things landscaping-wise, then go take care of the booth and finalize it, finally. Only took three days. So because of the storm last night, that's just the buildup of traffic now flying in. <laughs> oh, God. Oshkosh is definitely going to earn their title for busiest hour to this year for sure. All right, so plan changes because they're still not all ready. So I'm dropping Caleb off first so he can go do his work at Oshkosh. And then I'm going to go to Lowe's, pick up a few more things, get everything prepared, and then go pick up the children. <laughs> <laughs> okay, dropped Caleb off. 
So he's gonna be set. On the way in, there's a bunch of planes. I'll show you. A lot of people are drying their stuff off on their plane. Just keep putting their clothes out. So that seems to be the extent of the damage. It seems that most people just got really wet. Some tents moved around, but nothing crazy. All right, so now I'm gonna head to Lowe's and pick up everything I need to pick up. And then once again, get the children. Okay, so we have a slight addition to our plans today. So the owner of the company, Trey, and our CFO are flying into Appleton today, and we have the rental that we picked up the other day. So we need to take that rental, we need to drop it back off at Appleton so they can pick it up and then come back and continue our day setting up the booth. Franklin's just lost in the kitchen. He doesn't know what he's doing. Trying to get the dishwasher started. Ryan's watching random videos about seals attacking octopus. Mm -hmm. I don't know where Hunter and Charlie are. <laughs> All right, we got Charlie excited because he finally gets to sit in the front seat. Woo! <laughs> Motion. Uh, we got in the back there, well, oh, and Hunter got right in the way. What a oh. rude dude. <laughs> I thought you were trying to say It that. totally makes sense. As I said it, I was like, oh, wow, now I'm going to introduce Hunter. But uh, in the very, very far back in the other car is Franklin and Ryan. So we're all headed to Appleton. We're gonna see, it's a race between the GMC or Chevy Traverse and the Ford Escape versus Trey's M2 Citation. Ooh. <laughs> Tough. Tough, we can make it. Go for the prettier side. <laughs> all right, so we've made it to what, are we, what did I say this place is called? Uh, yeah. <laughs> so we're at, yeah, <laughs> FBF. Oh, uh, Platinum Fly Center? So. Oh. Oh. Where are you going, bud? What you doing? Eyes up here. Okay. <laughs> um, okay, so we're just sitting at Appleton Flight Center and we're waiting for Trey to show up. We'll hand him the keys and then we're gonna go our separate ways and continue to work at the booth so we can finish Farmer Franklin's landscaping project, so. <laughs> Trey has arrived. That's what Trey uses to fly the jet. <laughs> How was the flight? Did you enjoy it? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> oh, we're gonna ride with was it really fast? Yeah. Did you fly? No, Daddy. Oh, it wasn't you? No. I thought it was you. <laughs> I swore I saw my phone. I know, right? First officer over here. Yeah. All right, we are back at our booth. Take care of some final things. We got these rocks around the plains, make it look all pretty. And it almost looks like it already opened, but it's only Sunday. But. People are walking around like it's open right now. too and then it goes around the corner on the other side of the trees back there so we're now going to pick up daniel um daniel's at the airport he just landed um but he decided to tell me while i was still in oshkosh that he landed so now he's gonna have to wait there for about 30 minutes 
We're gonna go pick him up, do that, and then eat dinner. Gosh, gosh. We picked up a Daniel. They're comparing Sun and Fun right now. Yeah, this, is, this makes Sun and Fun look like a, like a hangout. <laughs> <laughs> they think they think Oshkosh is better than Sun and Fun. Absolutely. <laughs>